I do because the reason if you look at any software now, the games, you see them they're, they're deck compatible. Um, Steam have issued this thing where you deck you need a deck compatible game. It's a target for a developer. So if I can emulate a Steam Deck setup on my system as much as possible, then the games are going to have much more cap cap uh, compatibility. And it's really interesting. If you try and launch games from Steam just from the desktop, it's just like it's not a very pleasant experience. I can't even get Arc Raiders to launch off this desktop. It sort of crashes with a weird box in the top corner. Whereas when you do it in Games Group, it just launches, it just plays. So there's something to take away from that. And that's why I don't other people have got other solutions to do this. I think focusing on compatibility with this is the key thing. I mean, Linux is always all over the shop, isn't it? People are making their own distros and they're doing their own things. But a little bit of standardization in that world, especially for the thing that's driving the entire Linux movement, which is the gaming. If you can standardize the gaming, much like Steam have done, which has made it accessible, then that's great. But we don't want to have to use Steam OS, which is locked, and KDE Plasma all the time. So basically, you know, doing it this way means on Amarchi, we can have you know the the best of both worlds. We can have this operating system, which is great. Oh, I love it to death. And then I can flip and play games without doing any command line. Just a couple of keys and I'm in. And I'm, but the games are compatible because I had a lot of trouble. And I know looking at the Discord for Amarchi, there's lots of people talking about the games, they how to run individual games. There's all these workarounds. But with this, everything runs. All the games just work. And that's the beauty of doing it in games game.